Hello and welcome to week 14, the last week of the semester. Probably thought that would never happen when we started way back in September. All right, for this week, just like all of your other drafts, you will be receiving screencast comments from me. So wait until you receive those to start to finalize your project number three. I will be working steadily on those as soon as you turn them in um, in week 13. So you should uh, have those accessible and ready to help you revise. Um, if you have any questions always with those screencast comments or you have trouble accessing them, always feel free to let me know. Now, you're going to be turning in a portfolio on Monday, December 5th, which is the last day of the semester. In that portfolio, you're going to submit your project number three draft. So as soon as you finish your project number three draft, my suggestion is to go ahead and upload that into the portfolio. Um, it, you know, obviously you want it to be different from the final copy. So before you get in there and make corrections to that document, go ahead and upload your project number three draft into the portfolio. The other two pieces besides the final copy will be a research process reflection. And what I want you to think about, you just have to answer this in two or more complete sentences, but I want you to go back through and think about what you, you know, why you chose your topic, what you learned about it. Uh, if you answered your original research questions, how did the research process moving through these annotated bibliographies work for you? And what is a significant lesson that you learned as you move through this process? Um, in addition, now that one is question answer. So you just seen, need, you can copy that document, paste it into another document and add your answers right below it, or you can create a new document with just the answers, whatever is easiest for you. You also have a writing process reflection, and this one is a 600 to 800 word reflective essay. So think about what an essay is, intro body conclusion, maybe you'll have several body paragraphs, but you need to answer the questions that are bulleted below in a reflective essay format. As soon as you move through the process um, of finalizing that draft, begin writing this um, writing process reflection. The research process reflection though that we just talked about um, does not need, uh, you don't need to be done with your final copy to, to really work on that part of it. So just think about your order as you move through this week. You have an entire week, so we go past Sunday for the due date of this portfolio. And as you can see, when you get to that portfolio, you have plenty of room to upload multiple um, multiple files, but you're gonna turn in that project number three rough draft, the research process reflection, the writing process reflection, and your final copy. All right, now moving into the other pieces for this week. So like I said, steadily, you're gonna be getting those um, screencast comments, but you also need to complete a peer review. You only have until Tuesday to complete that peer review. So as, as you um, finish your draft, feel free to upload that draft into a forum post. You're gonna find a classmate's draft and answer these questions. And just as you did um, a couple of peer reviews ago, you can copy these questions right into your reply and answer the questions you know, below it or in a different color font, whatever's easiest for you, or you can simply put the answers into your reply. But you're gonna need to do that um, you know, so two posts per person, both posts are due on Tuesday, November 29th. So just be, you know, aware of these shifting dates. We had a lot of Sunday due dates and this week um, there are no Sunday due dates. So we have a Tuesday due date, a Friday due date, and a Monday of the next week due date. For discussion form number five, you're just going to simply um, put in your virtual order for pizza and a beverage and add one new thing that you learned this semester from your reading assignments. What's one thing you learned this semester from your classmates? Um, well, it didn't have to be just from your readings or your assignments, but just what's one new thing that you learned uh, throughout the semester? And then how will you spend the break before the next semester? For this one, you only need to post once, but if you'd like to respond to others, feel free to do so. Um, all right, so just a quick recap. You're looking at three different due dates, a Tuesday, a Friday, and a Monday. You've got the information um, regarding the extra pieces for your portfolio. 
And if you have any questions as we wrap up this semester, don't hesitate to ask.